I got up this morning and I, you know, I'm a huge coffee person. And the first thing I went for was the coffee machine to make it. And it's a nice coffee machine and all, you know, for a, for a room. It's a little lady bitty thing. Okay. And I went to pull it out and fill it up with water. And what do I find? I find mold floating in it. Because somebody put a tea bag in and didn't empty it. And housekeeping decided not to clean it out. We're here at the, <laughs> at the uh, wine convention. <laughs> I'm here with Zippo Greg. Yeah. And uh, we just dropped off a TV set for uh, Gary Vaynerchuk. Although he's not around. He's no, he's, uh, he's running around in a jet jersey, so we'll see. <laughs> so I brought my book. Hopefully he'll sign it for yeah. me. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to hang out with him. Did you bring your book? Yeah. Yep. Cool. Mm -hmm. Cool. And uh, we got everything set up. And uh, the place is packed. We're here early. But get a first glass of wine. <laughs> <laughs> and we have our official badges. Yep. For wine Library. I'm with Wine Library. Yeah. And uh, we're going to be trying to broadcast for most of the day and drinking lots of wine and eating lots of cheese. So hopefully we won't bind up. Yeah. <laughs> cool. So we got Zippo here. He's uh, he's gearing up. We, Gary just came over. They're going to be doing some some filming. I guess this is NBC. <laughs> first things first. Yeah. I did not. You know, I'd love to say I did, but I uh, I was hoping for uh, I was hoping to sneak into the playoffs. I knew we had a big D. Lost Jenkins and Leon Washington. I definitely was worried. And then uh, they made this amazing run. So, you know, I traveled to Cincy. I was in San Diego last week. I'm leaving tonight to go to Indy. <laughs> One more win. And the first Super Bowl of my life. You know, I'm growing my playoff beer. This is not my normal thing. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a very happy boy right now. The book selling to Wine Library TV, to retailing business. Yeah. You traded in for a test. Yes, I would. I would be. I would wow. have no problem starting all over, even at 34 years old, enough to pay me for my, you know, maybe my rent because I do have a child now. But for a Jets Super Bowl, I'd be willing to start over. I want it bad. <laughs> okay, so we're having an awesome time here at the at the Wine Expo. We just we were just interviewed by uh, NBC affiliate. Yeah. That's what he was saying. He was. So, so I was like, okay. So we interviewed the NBC affiliate. We were talking about uh, real estate and social media and well, really transparency and how the internet's basically changing the planet. Um, we met we met up with uh, Gary, and uh, we're going to meet up with him again a little he's bit later. Easy to find. He's got a green uh, <laughs> jet shirt on. You know, he's uh, some rock star. Yeah. He really is. I have a man crush. I, I do. I'll admit it. <laughs> I'm a do. man crush. Yeah, uh, I don't. Tell him too, I don't. But, but uh, apparently, I, I do. Yeah. <laughs> I love him, man. He's, he's awesome. a good guy. Oh, yeah. He's a, he's a California. Uh, you know, it would be nice if we could get him to get to do an interview on virtual media real estate. I, I would love that. Yeah. So he talks about real estate in his book a few times. Yeah. So. Yeah. So transparency. Absolutely. Yeah. So we're having a fine time. We're gonna go so drink. I'm gonna, I'm gonna flip you. <laughs> we're gonna flip go. It. We're gonna. <laughs> we're gonna go drink some more wine and yeah. have some more, uh, some more cheese and snacks. Absolutely. Because we're getting a little bit tipsy. Yeah. You getting tipsy? Yeah. Go to the bathroom. <laughs> Is that more information than? Yeah. You probably need? a little bit too much. <laughs> All, right. All right. See ya. We'll talk to you later. And. Um, so, you know, the other guy was asking about, about you know, social media and stuff, yep. which you've obviously you've crushed it already, right. you know. At this point, do you think you're building not personal brand, but you're building your legacy? Is that what you're... You know, that's my big video, right? Legacy is greater than currency. Right? Yeah. yeah, absolutely. I mean, I think I'm doing both, right? I think, I think everybody's building legacy right now in a world where there's flip cams like this, <laughs> right? Yeah. This video will be watched by my great grandkids. Yes. Crazy. And they'd be like, why did Grandpa have a beard for a few minutes? Because the Jets That's kids. Right. Because the Jets. <laughs> you know, I, I think we're, we're, we're leaving a social footprint because of the world we live in. And so I think about legacy all the time. Okay, so we're still going. The general public is coming in now, so things are getting kind of crazy. <laughs> Greg and I are still, still freaking strong. <laughs> wanted to sell me a $20 wine glass. I said, I got a free one right here. Why would I want to buy that? 
<laughs> Plus, I have like four at home. She's like, oh, you only have four? <laughs> oh, we got Harry Carey over here. Get those glasses. Isn't that Harry Carey? <laughs> okay, so we're still here at the at the Wine Expo. Things have gotten really crazy now. Uh, Billy Costas, we just had a picture with Billy Costas. He's, uh, he's, got, a, he's got a show on TV. And uh, the general public is here now. And you can see how packed it is. It's like craziness. You know, early in the morning when we were here, we could kind of pretty much go where we want, have some wine, and so forth. But now it's just nuts. So. That's pretty funny. A woman just approached me and said, I'm videoing myself. Yeah, and I was like, yes, I know. <laughs> so, hey, it's all about transparency and who you are. So we're finishing day one. Day one is over. Day one. Day one. It's been a, it was a fantastic time. Cheers. <laughs> there was a lot of alcohol consumed. That's right. A lot of wine. Yes. We're heading for Chinese food now. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Kowloon's, like I need baby. More Kowloon's. calories. Okay, so we're at Kowloon's. <laughs> we're just finishing up. Greg, finishing what do you think? up. Is it good? Finishing up with some bread and butter. <laughs> Always. And the scorpion bowl. Yeah, oh yeah. Scorpion bowl for two? <laughs> so what do you think of the Wine Expo day one? What do you think? I mean, I love Gary V. Well, just, just forget Gary V for a second. What do you think of the Wine Expo? I don't know how much it was. I think it was $175 <laughs> for two days, but... Well, you didn't pay anything. <laughs> I would say it's very well worth yeah. it, right? I mean, well, the mere fact that you can pretty much drink wine well from all over the planet. Going. Yeah, I mean, and as much as you want. Yeah, I would definitely say it's uh, the foie gras itself oh, was worth it. God, yeah, it not a wine, by the dude. way. Yeah, we had. I must have had like four pieces of it. Yeah. Not exactly the healthiest thing for you to eat. <laughs> I told Rob, I said, Rob, there's this guy has foie gras. Rob's like, where? What? Come on, I love I love program. <laughs> it was really good. It was. So it's it's been an awesome awesome day, and it's all gonna happen again tomorrow. So yeah, that's a scary. Man. <laughs> scary. Yeah. So Greg's gonna pick me up tomorrow morning. And we're gonna do it all over again, and then I'll be flying out, and I'll be back in Tampa tomorrow night. So out of this cold and into the warmth. But anyways, thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. You're welcome. Thanks, man. You're welcome.